question I've been posed today is do I think English 145 is the most important class that I've ever taken at Cal Poly? Now I believe that that's asking two separate questions. First off, do I believe for me that it was the most important class? To answer that, I say no. I think because of my upbringing, I was already a good critical thinker. Of course, there's always more to learn. But I think I took less out of the class than most people would. Now that brings us to our other option here. Other students. Is this the most important class at Cal Poly for them? Well, I would say yes. Uh, I do believe that students taking this class who've not been classically trained in rhetoric or in critical thinking can really take lots of information out of this class. I think that there are two powerful segments of this class that students can take the most out of. The first, of course, being the introduction or improvement of the use of rhetorical devices, as well as the recognition of rhetorical devices in argumentative writing. I think that students are not typically trained in every element of rhetoric, and in fact, they're very poorly trained in it. I think in English 145, we learn some very important things about how to recognize when rhetorical devices are used and how they're used so that we're not duped by those who would use it unfairly and so we know further what it is that we're using these devices for. I think a second true element in this is the ability to form an argument. Truly, most people are not argumentative people. In fact, those who are argumentative often do not know how to form a proper argument. So I believe that through this class, people can form better arguments. And in fact, in light of recent events with slow solidarity, uh, I believe the document that they put out, their 41 demands to administration, could really have been helped if they had taken English 145. I found the document to be somewhat rhetorically bland. They did not make a good argument. And in fact, I find myself that I've taken this out of English 145 in that now I can recognize when an argument is bland when it doesn't make any sense, or in fact when it's you know, false. I think further, I'm able to better recognize now uh, the ethos of a person, and in fact the ethos of an argument as a whole. Now this is important for deciding which arguments to follow, or which arguments even to consider. So, in all, there's a lot to take out of English 145, and I think for the majority of students, this is most, one of the most important classes that they will ever take in Cal Poly.